Hey guys, welcome to an Erin Condren haul. I haven't had one of these in so long. You can see I have a good size box here. I don't even remember everything I ordered. I already looked at it, but it's been sitting here for a little while. So welcome back to planner videos. I ordered myself a new planner so that I could start planning again. I miss it. I haven't planned on camera, especially probably over a year at least. I can't even remember. You guys probably know better than I do. So I ordered, I went ahead and ordered since the new Erin Condren came out a couple of months ago. I went ahead and ordered myself one so I could start fresh. I had a bunch, I had like three left over from last year that still had the remainder of 2018 in them, but I really wanted one that was going to get me through 2019 and kind of use it as my like back to school planner. <laughs> even though I've been using an app on my phone called Acal Light and I love it to kind of organize my life it would be nice to go back to paper planning so if you're new to Erin Condren Erin Condren is a I would consider more of a luxury planner it is more on the pricey side you can easily get up into 70 and 80 dollars worth of a planner so if you're new to them and you've never signed up I will leave a link down below where you can get ten dollars off of your first purchase and then they actually have a rewards program where the more you purchase the more points you accumulate and then um, you also after so many orders are eligible for more coupons and a referral program so if you're interested I will leave it in the bottom bar below but let's jump right into what I got I'm super excited so I'm going to start off with the best thing that I'm very excited about I have the monitor on so you may hear autumn tossing and turning here in a little while but this is the planner that I got which like I said I'm very excited for. Oh, it's so beautiful. I think this cover is one of the ones that it you can customize it, but it comes, it shows you this color, and I love this color for fall, the mustard. And I have so many covers that I wanted something different. I could have got it easily with pink, which would have been beautiful as well. But I don't I only have one other thing in even like a yellow. So I really wanted the mustard. So the flowers come this color. The background is called mustard, in case you're wondering. So I went with the 2018 through 2019 horizontal colorful planner with black uh, binding. This is an extra $10. The platinum comes free. You can do gold, black, or rose gold. And I did rose gold last time, I believe. And I have a platinum one already. I've never had black, so I really wanted to try the black. It comes with a ruler, which is also good to like kind of mark your place, to measure things out. It has a protective film over it. I have so many of those because I've been using Erin Condren for a long time. So this is what I just got my first and last name on it. And it's a typical cover that has where you can write on the inside. So this is the On The Go Life Planner. And like I said, I got the hourly layout in colorful. I've had black and white before and I prefer the color, but black and white is nice for just a simplistic look. So this is what it looks like. The paper and everything feels really nice. This starts in July, which we're clearly already at the end of July. So it starts in July and it goes through June of 2019 which is perfect because it gives you just enough time if you want to order another one and it goes through the school year, which is something that I really like. And usually by May, June, Erin Condren has already released the planner for the July, you know, so you, you never miss a beat. So that's what that looks like in the back. It has some notes pages. Um, and I think this one's a little different yeah it has this is different this is not I've never had this in a notebook before so it has line pages and then dot grid pages which is really cool and then it also has coloring pages which is super cute as well I've never had that in an Erin Condren I don't believe it's probably something new and then oh that's new too there's a little area for like name email address whatever like an address book that's new. I don't remember. The paper feels really nice, like I said. Then there's the, um, like, next year at a glance. And stickers. The stickers are super cool. Definitely updated. Um, but I think last year's planner had these same stickers in them. And then there's the folder. Keep it together folder in the back. 
with the perpetual calendar which I have so many of these it's not even funny so many of them but they are great to keep people's birth dates um, it pretty much is it's not even just birth dates it's like lunch dates meeting important meetings birth dates events it's pretty much just a like month at a glance which is kind of cool if you do have school events for your kids or you know anything like that I like looking at it in a monthly spread but this is cool and then you can also do contacts and passwords and things in the back of that so that's the planner I'm really excited to get back into it like I said I definitely will be doing some plan with me so if you guys are inter interested in those definitely you know hit the little bell notification subscribe those are coming back because I love do, I loved doing them it was so real calming and relaxing it was something I could do when the girls went to bed but it was for me you know nobody else but for me so I'm really excited to get in, back into them they of course sent the little freebies and then also with this which I've already dug into I sent a code to my best friend Via so she could get her planner but it comes with the clear pouch with a bunch of little things in it I actually use this I like to keep extra stickers and sometimes pins and things and it. it can bulk it up really quickly but it comes with this sticky divider thing and all I do is just put it on here and stick it at the back of my notebook I typically plan right around my where my pins and my stickers and stuff are so you know that's not necessary but if you'd like to travel and you like to take things with you and your planner goes with you then the pouch is a good thing to have because you can travel you don't even have to attach it or put it inside the Erin Condor and you can stick it on the outside that's a great thing about the little um, clip is that you can just put it right outside like where the ruler is and then they send you some stickers and some little tags for a little freebie to go in that and then another coupon too. Is this a coupon? No, it's just a, comp a thing explaining what it is. I pretty much every time I look on the Erin Condren website, I look for anything that's new and I order it because I want to know what all the new things. Erin Condren doesn't sponsor me. Although if you're watching Erin Condren and you want to send me stuff and sponsor me boxes every once in a while, I will gladly take them. <laughs> but they don't. So I have to continuously look up there on there I'm subscribed to their newsletter I follow them on social media so that I can see the new things that come out one thing that came out that's fairly new is the habit tracker and it actually comes with stickies on the back so you can hang it up on your fridge if you know if you don't want to magnetize it or you can put it on your desk so that it doesn't move but this is really cool it's a small actions every day lead to big things so you can have um, any type of habit on here, whether it's washing your face, you know, flossing multiple times, or at least once a day, or um, cleaning the dishes, <laughs> doing one load of laundry. I think I'm gonna do that for household chores. Keep this on my fridge and list the things that I wanna get done throughout the week and see which days I actually get them done to come up with more of a like cleaning schedule. But you can list your habit here and then it has Monday through Friday, Monday through Sunday and you can um, check it off whenever you do it. So I think that this is really cool. I don't know how many come in here, but it's, I would say at least half, like six months worth. So I picked up that and then these things, I've been wanting to collect all of them for so long and I think I'm actually still missing one. I could be wrong. But I'm, I think I may be missing one. So Erin Condren came out with these things called the Petite Planners, which I'm super excited about. I actually use their monthly, deluxe monthly notebook as my budgeting book for the year. But I wanted to pick up this one just to see the difference. I mean, clearly it's a lot more compact, easier to travel with, but I'm sure it doesn't have as many features. So I picked this up to check it out. It is, um, like I said, the Petite Planner. I have some of the baby books already, journal, pregnancy journaling, even though I'm not pregnant. But I bought, I've bought all of them. They're very reasonably priced, somewhere between like $10 and $15, maybe $12. And they each have their own little things. So this one is the budgeting book. So I'm excited to check that one out. And then this one is the wellness log. Again, excited to check this one out. I do have the little mini wellness book that I use to take my measurements and things. So I'm excited to see what this one is. I use my fitness pal, which is great because I always have my phone on me. But again, I want to go back to more of paper planning. So I'm excited to see this. The meal planner. This was something I was really excited about as well. This one looks like it has 
um, like a Sunday through Saturday breakfast, lunch, and dinner, which is really cool, and then a grocery list on the side. And this one was out of stock for a long time, so this is the meal planner, and I believe each of them comes with, I'm going to open one and find out, but I believe they come with stickers, because I know when you order them online, you can order individually the stickers, yeah. So they each have this little pocket in the back with a sheet of stickers to go with it that is you know around like this one's a meal planner so it's a bunch of food stickers grocery shopping stickers things like that oh i'm so excited oh this one has a price tracker recipe log that's cool dinner party meal planning there's a bunch of those and then this is the meal prep so you can do uh, your meal planning here and then your grocery list does this tear out no, it's not perforated, but that would kind of be cool if it is perforated because I actually did want to get one that Shelly's Home Life recommends. I forget what it's called, but she recommends one and you can write out your like monthly meal list or your weekly um, meal plan with a shopping list that's perforated. You can tear it out and take it to the store with you, so that's kind of cool. And then the last petite journal I got is the travel journal. So again, I'm really excited. You guys know we love to travel and I'm excited to see how we can keep this kind of up to date. Also comes with stickers, um, places to visit next time, daily adventure. So this is what, oh cool. So it starts with, okay, so it starts with a trip itinerary uh, packing list, places to visit, reservations and to-dos, and then it goes into daily adventures, which is really cool. So you can see like reservations and to-dos, a packing list over here, which I actually utilized the Erin Condren packing list already, places to visit, and then your trip itinerary, and then on this is what the basic things look like, daily adventures. So you can go back in and fill things out, like what you're gonna wear that day, that's awesome. How much everything costs, favorite moment from the day, and you can write like a little something about it, what you eat, oh, that's really cool. I'm super excited for this one as well. So those were on my top two to, top to do, top to buy list from Erin Condren, as well as the new planner. And then I did find a couple more things while I was on there that I thought were cool. This is a Snap-in dashboard, and it is um, one that has top priorities, and then a habit tracker at the bottom. If you didn't want to use like a paper tracker, you could definitely use this one. I don't know if I can get it to focus, but habit tracker. And then on the back, there is a um, meal plan, like Monday through Sunday meal plan. So I thought that was kind of cool. If you don't want to use paper, this is something that you could reuse and reuse. And then I have one of these for um, meal planning. It came in a different print and it has like a Monday through Sunday with a list here so you could do a grocery list and then your meal planning and you could hang this on your fridge so your family knows what's going on they could add things to the list this one I got again for meal planning but it also could be for just planning in general and I love that this one's perforated so the list is perforated from the scheduling and I love the rose gold on here and I believe this one was on sale so that is what I got from Erin Condren. Leave a comment down below if you're excited for the planner videos to come up. And if you have any ideas or anything you want to see specifically, let me know in the comments below. Again, I haven't filmed a planner video in so long. I'm really excited, but I'm a little nervous because I remember them being long to edit, long to film, constantly missing things that I was supposed to bring with me and I forgot I had to get up and go get or I wasn't exactly sure of my entire schedule, you know, so I'm excited but nervous. So hopefully you guys are just as excited and not nervous as I am. Let me know in the comments down below, like I said, some of the things that you specifically wanna see. And hopefully you enjoyed this one and we will see you in the next one. Bye.